I, I just wonder. <laughs> I mean, technically speaking, Bob, Alex, don't all of us, didn't all of us reach Shakespeare back in high school? Yes. <laughs> we all yeah, but not in third grade or kindergarten or whatever the fuck Alex is telling me. I learned oh. old English before I learned English. Because I watched that weird Romeo and Juliet, but it was a bunch of gangs, and uh. Longsword was a shotgun. <laughs> oh wait, you mean uh, West Side, Side Story? Story? Was that what it was? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know? <laughs> I, don't even remember. I just oh, remember vaguely watching shit. a movie. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you, Lieutenant. Okay, to be fair, the drama teacher didn't preface it as uh, modern retelling. Oh, well, you know more, what? More I saw Macbeth, but with the lions. What? Lion King. Dost you know, thou spit at thee? I'm six me now? What? <laughs> That's like the one thing I remember from Macbeth <laughs> aside from the... What was it? Troubled... What? It's like the Cauldron scene with the fucking witches. Trouble, trouble, toil and trouble. Yeah, yeah you yeah. know what? Macbeth, yeah, make Macbeth deserved everything that came to him because he listened to three <laughs> homeless ladies. Cooking hobo soup on the side of the road. So from what I understand, it depends on the version, but like who's I think more complicit, his, either him or his wife. But yeah, they're kind of both. No, look, they're both complicit, but Macbeth's reasoning is stupid. He got a fortune supposedly from three homeless women on the side of the road. Right, but yeah. his on the wife version. was just power hungry and ambitious. He That's was girl bossing all over the place, and he was like, "These homeless women got it their shit together." Two very different things. He didn't do it out of support or love for his wife. No, no, no. That's not what I mean. The wife, was, depending on the version, I, from what oh. I understand, it was. Oh no. Oh, wait, 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 w